Good morning, Rachel. Good morning. How are you? Good, good. It's Saturday morning, afternoon. How would Hopefully Sally? everybody is well. It's a beautiful day out. A cold front came through. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's nice. So it's breezy, so. only going to be 80, but I think two days from now it's going to be 90. So have fun. Thanks. Thanks. Appreciate it. And that storm got weaker, so we're hoping it just stays weak and does what it's going to do and brings a little bit of rain but if not we'll be watering like always rain would be okay but yeah. no rain would be great if it could rain wednesday and thursday all day that would be awesome yeah that'd be perfect but um so we're at our big one we're mowing today and we have a couple more we're going to get mowed probably and then we're just going to go back home and relax on the farm right yeah <laughs> we're going to get out and mow yeah. this one i'm probably not going to record much because it's just a big one. I'll get you some mountains back here there, comes. but here he comes. No humidity in the air. You can see everything in the mountains today. And it is windy. But I'm going to finish mowing this up. I actually mowed that a pretty straight line with one hand. Not bad. I'm not going to play around again. If I hit that post, I'll be hurt. Let me get this done. Rachel is over there with the bee getting that done. Beautiful day to mow. She's got her rocking her hat with her little, it has a, um, a face shield attached to it. So why is it every time you run out of gas, you run out of gas the furthest away from the trailer? It always happens like that. You never are up by the trailer when you run out of gas. I didn't think I was low, but I guess I should check it. So now I gotta walk and go get gas. Eh, I'm just gonna leave it there and weed eat. I'll go back and get it later and finish mowing. I'm gonna go weed eat where Rachel did. So, not bad, beautiful day out. I think they're a little behind on mowing that over there. But let me go weed eat some. All right, so let's put our stripes in over here. messes with the rest of this yard and then I'll go back down there and get my weed eater all the way down at the end of the road. I mean my weed eater, my mower all the way to the end of the road.
So here's the only other one we're going to do for today, this one. Um, it's not much, but we're going to get it done and then go back home and play on the farm. What happened? I striped this lawn really pretty, that's what happened. No, it's not. Okay, go put the mower back, we're done. I can't. You didn't even finish. Oh, yeah, that's right, you ran out of gas. Okay, guys, I guess I gotta go get the boss some gas. Boss is over there complaining she's in the sun. I'm right in the sun. So we were lazy and we got two done. Yeah. But it was our big one, and then one that was a little bit behind because he's a two-weeker. But it wasn't even that long, was it? No. Well, I had to dry. drop it down to like three and a half. Yeah. Everything's still dry. Oh, and we're not yeah. supposed to get rain ever again. Oh, that tropical storm really broke up? It's going to be a tropical storm still, but I think it's going to go off kind of the south, east, east, not oh. get into the mountains. Did you guys like how I made Carl do the walk of shame again? <laughs> yeah, I had to do it because I ran out of gas and then she ran out of gas. You ran out of gas twice this week. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I try to get better about remembering to look, but the beast is like the gas tank is so big that like yeah, usually when you, you fill it, time. yeah, I last a long time. The Z1, I, yeah, I don't know. But I ran out of in both mowers this week. Yeah, the Z1 and the Z3. And I ran out of mine. So we ran out of gas in every mower this week. <laughs> we did that. You know what that means? You should always make sure your tanks are full. Yeah. But it is the end of the week. So, and we did mow a pretty decent amount this week. Yeah. So we're, we're going to end the video. Well, we're going to do our ending here, but it wasn't that long. So we'll go do some stuff in the garden. Yeah, later. there's still some stuff that I want to do in the garden for sure. So yeah. we can give you guys a little update. I know that you guys like seeing it, especially when everything starts growing like ridiculously. So, yeah. so please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And be happy, guys. Or at least try. Have a good Have night. Have a good night. So guys, we are out here in the garden. Um, this stuff has been kind of neglected over here. Well, every car in the neighborhood goes by when I come out here. Um, I haven't watered it in a while. Look, it's bone dry. So I'm going to come out here and work on this. So you guys can come along with me. We're going to do some garden cleanup. We're going to cut all the leaves off the cucumbers. Well, not all of them. Only up to a certain height to open up some light for these and get some more airflow into there. And then I'm going to clean all this up. But everything is looking good. And I want to cut all these. I'll show you guys in a minute. But let me get this done first. So we're gonna see if this thing starts. It's been sitting for a couple hours now. Um, what was it? Somebody said, what did they say? Don't put the choke on, which I'm not gonna do. And don't pull the trigger. And it should start. Other people have said, hold the trigger in and it should start. Now this is a new weed eater. It's only got 28 and a half hours on the to whole thing. But let's see, hopefully it just starts. Okay, that's one, two, three four so it's not going to start just me pulling it obviously but now i already got fuel into it okay let's try holding the trigger in and starting it actually let's see if it's got gas we did trim a whole yard it has gas i guess it's been sitting too long so now we're going to go to choking it
Okay, so one thing I forgot to do before I started was this right here. So what I do is I just come over here and I let the water run in this for a while. And I am gonna come back and rewater them with fertilizer. Um, an organic fertilizer, one gallon. So I am going to clear all the dead out of here. So guys, I know it looks like I killed a lot of my plants and cut them up. But with my cucumbers, I usually clean the bottom up because I don't want any disease or anything from the bottom. And the leaves don't need to be there. You can see the cucumbers are doing fine. I did it once already. And then usually suckers that are running off the sides, I cut off, but I'm gonna leave them up this high. What I was going for is at least to get some of these plant flowers in here some light in the afternoon because they're completely shaded by these cucumbers and now i can come in here since it's pretty late we have new tomatoes coming i'll plant the tomatoes in between where the buckets are like right here right here but on this side and then these will out they'll be done and then i can have tomatoes come up on here so i'm going to finish going down here and getting all this done so there we go i got all this stuff hacked up all deadheaded, all watered. The only thing I'm going to do, I'll probably get up in the morning and fertilize all this. And tomorrow is Sunday the 4th. Guys, we didn't end up getting alive. I forgot that um, the neighbor was having a big 4th of July party and fireworks. So we don't want to be in the middle of a live while they're doing that. But look, look at all these cucumbers. Everything's looking good. The grass is working for there. Everything I pruned up for these flowers to get some more light down in there. Um, and once they all reach up further and we do our next picking, obviously you can see we gotta pick some cucumbers. There's so many on them. Looking good. So the next project in the garden before we move on, I don't have Rachel out here to clean all that up. The next project is Rachel's okra bed. She'll be really happy if I get all this cleaned out. So there is a bunch of things that are dead in it. Like these pots, they need water. Um, there's green beans in here. Look, purple green beans. So I'm going to go ahead and get this cleaned out. And we will see you guys tomorrow.